During 2020 and 2021, I was buying and selling a lot of weight equipment. Iron weight plates were by far what I bought and sold the most of. The trick was to buy rusty plates for pennies on the dollar, clean them up, give them a fresh coat of paint, and either keep them for myself or sell them for profit. Every time I posted a video about cleaning the rust off my plates, I would receive so many comments saying I was removing pounds of weight from each plate. I'm no scientist, but I don't think rust is that heavy. I set out to test this theory with a very rusty 45 pound plate. Before cleaning anything, the plate weighs 47 pounds and 8.2 ounces. That's 21.55 kilograms for anyone using the metric system. For people asking why this 45 weighs over 47 pounds, weight plates can be over or under by a few pounds. It's pretty common. The only plates guaranteed to be accurate are calibrated weight plates, and they tend to be a bit more expensive. Okay, my go-to method for cleaning the rust is an angle grinder with a wire brush head. I've been told to try all sorts of stuff. Evapo rust, vinegar, sandblasting, electrolysis, whatever that is. But I do it this way because I already have the tools and I don't have to wait days for the results. It takes me about 20 minutes to remove most of the rust. This is good enough for me. I get rid of the dust and clean the surface. Then I apply an even coat of spray paint. I'm using Rust-Oleum Antique Pewter because it's the closest match to the original paint color and has a slightly textured finish. Once that dries, I throw it back onto the scale. 47 pounds, 7.8 ounces or 21.54 kilograms. That means cleaning and repainting caused the weight to lose 0.4 ounces or 11.33 grams. That's roughly the weight of a handful of almonds. It's not nothing, but quite a difference from the suggested one to five pounds from the comment section. Before you yell at me, it's already been pointed out that I didn't weigh it before adding paint. I'll make sure to do that next time. I still got a few rusty plates in my garage. What else should I try next time? Let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.